if you watch Kenny Pickett and Malik Willis practice, you're going to automatically think, damn, Malik Willis got this guy on talent. Yeah. And that's not a knock on Kenny Pickett. Malik Willis, dude, he has the arm strength. He has the ability to move in the pocket. Not, excuse me, not move in the pocket, but just be a runner. Like, he's dynamic as shit. <laughs> but it's just scary when you look at the offense he played in one. How impre- Were you impressed with his progression skills? I was like, holy shit, dude, can you look anywhere else? How many times do you throw the ball over the middle of the field? How many times do you throw an NFL route? No. Yeah, you can throw the ball 60 yards, but if you can't hit fucking water out of a boat, it's not worth it. Yeah. Shout out to our video, but this Malik Willis was literally the inspiration to that video. That was the whole reason why that ah, me and Max, I mean, a little Trey Lance in there, too. No, but it was it was really Malik Willis who sparked it because of the things I was hearing about Malik. And I'm going to sound like a broken record, but everyone is going to think that they can get their hands on this kid and they're going to turn him into a guy like Josh Allen, a project QB. And it's just simply, it's simply unfair because these guys are going to be held to a different standard, which is just not fair. Not, it's just it's not, not fair, fair at all. And Malik Willis, is he an interesting prospect? Yes, but he is raw as shit. He's a project. He has a lot of work to do. What do you like about him? Just off bat. I mean, he can make people miss. He's very agile. He's not He's not a fast that guy. That doesn't fill me with a lot of confidence when that's the number one thing you right. said about my quarterback. And the arm the arm talent. I it's mean, I'm there. sorry. The Zach, everyone wants to point to the Zach Wilson pro day because everyone's throwing that stupid freaking deep ball. And everyone's impressing people with that throw. You yeah. know what throw I'm talking, talking yeah, yeah, about? Yeah, where he's drifting left. Yeah, and everyone's yeah, starting yeah, to yeah. do it because uh, Zach, Zach Wilson, Wilson did it. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry, that doesn't that doesn't wow me. Like your film at the end of the day is what I'm gonna go off of, not a throw that you're doing in basketball shorts. Sorry, kid. Like doesn't impress me. No, I agree with you. And you look at the college offense, it's all RPO heavy, it's little dumb screens. When he pulls down the ball, I didn't see him look to throw it. He's like, Okay, I'm gonna pull it down. I'm at liberty, I'm the best athlete on the field. I'm just gonna run. Yeah. And can you coach that guy out of that? Is that guy gonna get to the NFL and be like I'm the best athlete here. And then he's going to get destroyed by Fred Warner yeah, or anyone like that. I didn't see a lot of touch throws. It was like, I'm going to throw a bullet. I'm going to throw a deep ball. And it, that same thing we said about Trey Lance. It's like, hey, can you show me some diversity with your throws? Can you fit a ball over a middle linebacker under the safety? No. That's an NFL throw. And he's a small dude. When, it, when I mean by small is, yeah, he's 220, which is good. He's six feet tall. That's not a big quarterback. And I, I know I'm going to sound like an old man, but, you know, height matters to me at quarterback a little bit because you see Kyler Murray every F in year. And people are going to point to Russell Wilson. Russell Wilson's an anomaly. Yeah. And he has a kind of a wonky, like, uh, release. It, sometimes it's kind clean. Kind of Trey Lance-like. Sometimes it's clean. Sometimes it's like, it's like what Very the hell? Where are your feet going? Your your foot's pointed at 12 o'clock. You're going to the left, all the way to the left. What the fuck are you doing? Yeah. And there's no pocket presence. There's absolutely nothing, but it's college offense. He's never been taught that. A lot of work to do with this kid. And like you were talking about the Josh Allen video, which you guys should all check out, by the way. How many teams are going to give this kid three years to grow into who he could be? Exactly. That's not how the – if he goes to Pittsburgh, I'd be like, he could be it. If he goes to freaking – Let's just say he went to a shitty team like the um, the Texans. It's like, oh, we're going to clean house in a year. Okay. Well, I don't know. <laughs> so I don't think so. Look, I liked Willis more than Matt Corral just because I like the upside, and I just like the arm talent a little more.